This is going to be one of many videos that I make of this computer, Hackintosh slash gaming PC. And uh, I will make a video about the overview of how the experience was, like all the drivers, all the troubleshooting issues that I had. And I'll also probably make a video about the graphics card, which is GTX 960. But let's get on with the specs since this is a benchmarking video. So I have Intel 4590, which turbos to 3.7 gigahertz. And if you guys can see, it's showing as 3.7 gigahertz. So I'm assuming that it's running full at all time, 8 gigs of RAM and GTX 960 with a 5400 RPM. Now the hard computer drive. that I'm comparing against is the non-retina MacBook Pro 13 inch model. You can still buy it and here is the specs for it. So this has, I think, Intel 3210M. It turbos to 3.1 gigahertz, 4 gigs of RAM, Intel HD 4000, and I did upgrade to a SSD. And I'll, show, I'll talk about that later. This is probably my favorite benchmarking software. Uh, you can run this on Mac, Windows, probably in Linux as well. It tests your graphics card or OpenGL. It also tests your CPU using this live rendering image. And you guys can see that this is a quad core processor uh, because it has those four squares or it might be rectangle actually filling up the image. So this is what I get on the Hackintosh, 85 frames per second and 549 CB. So this has a GTX 960. Now I ran the same benchmark on Windows just to see how it compares. And yeah, it performs a lot better when Windows, especially for OpenGL. You guys can see it gets humongous compared to uh, the Hackintosh. So here's comparing all three of the benchmarks. So on my left, I have Mac operating system on the Hackintosh and then the middle one is Windows on the Hackintosh and the third one is my MacBook Pro which is just like not even comparable it's so bad another very popular benchmarking software unfortunately I only got was able to run it on 32-bit because the 64-bit is not free but here is the score for single core 3400 and for multi-core 10891 you do get just a tad bit better on windows and <laughs> comparing it against the macbook pro it's just a joke it's like it's super bad i mean more than 1000 for single core and a double on the hackintosh for multi-core this is a fairly new benchmarking software and it's showing up as it's not detecting the 960 for some reason it might be and it's just not showing it but I'm not sure but this is what I got on the Hackintosh score of 898 and when you compare that against my MacBook Pro uh, 627 so I'm not completely sure whether it's using the GTX 960 or not but that is what I get and I don't think it's available on Windows now here is a disk speed test. I'm going to be using a Blackmagic uh, disk speed test. Amazing software. Uh, like I said, I am salvaging a hard drive from a laptop that I no longer use. Not the best result, but I did upgrade my MacBook Pro to a SSD and I'll, I'll also get a result of how it performs with the hard drive that it came with. So this is what I get with the SSD yeah like amazing scores and this is what i get with the hard drive 61 and around 73 megabytes per second which is less than the hackintosh so i made the entire video that you guys are watching right now using my hackintosh just to prove to you guys that i am indeed using the hackintosh here's the system specification and you guys can see my graphics card along with the specs so let's take a look at final cut pro x i didn't have any problem at all uh, i'm not sure whether it's using the intel hd 4600 or uh the graphics card i'm hoping that's using the graphics card if it's not there's 
no way to tell I mean I guess I can do rendering and see how that works but you guys can see I'm filming using QuickTime or screen recording and it's still uh, perform performing amazingly so I just wanted to share that with you guys anyway guys thank you for watching this video uh, be sure to like this video if you want more Hackintosh content. If I get more dislikes than like, then you know, I know you guys don't want to see any more Hackintosh content and I will stop making them.